Okay, so you want to make an organizational or hierarchy chart in Whimsical, and hopefully you are already logged in. Um, but what you want to do is get logged in, of course. You can create a board um, and then come over here to where it says start with a template and browse all templates. Um, there's a couple ways to get to templates, but I'm just going to assume you have a board and maybe you're wondering where to start with. And we can now start looking for, let's start with org. And right away, we can see a bunch of uh, different ways to do this. Org chart, flow chart, that looks like a pretty standard one. Um, org chart with photos, that might be nice. Here's a simpler one that looks kind of like a mind map. So let's try one of these out and go from there. Okay, so right away it's got it laid out really nicely. Um, and so we can double click and go ahead and start editing this. Um, I'm just gonna put my name at the top and then we can see that there's some nice helpful, um, I guess, tool tips over here. We can see this will create an adjacent or the same level. Um, and then this will create a next level down. So let's create this and I'm just gonna name this. Uh, this is the CTO, um, this is the CFO. And then we can see how we could create more and more. Let's say we wanted to put some people. Interesting that it connected down there. Um, let me move some of this stuff out of the way. And I have a feeling this is going to be what's the issue. With the first one I did, I didn't have that issue because I had it up on a bigger screen. But now we're going to go down and we can create a few more so that these all um, come together. So let's actually delete that one. And we're going to use this again. Okay, so we just have person one and then person, whoops, didn't mean to do that. Let's get rid of that. And then person two. Okay, now that I'm done messing this up, I uh, just wanted to show how easy it is to really get in here and start knocking this out. And then, of course, you, there's a lot you can do, right? You can change the color, shape, the, the, a lot of the text options. You can make things transparent. Um, you know, if you need to click and drag, we could move this over here. If we needed the CFO to be, you know, on the left side for some reason, um, there's a lot that we can do. So uh, really easy to get started with. And again, as there were so many templates to choose from, you know, you could use this one. You could use the one with images. Um, you know, there's a lot that you can customize and Whimsical makes it very easy to use. And as I'm scrolling around, I'm just hitting the space bar. Um, and that allows me to go from selecting things to panning around. Of course, you can always um, zoom in and out as well. So hopefully this gets you started making your org chart in Whimsical. If uh, you like this and you're looking at other org chart uh, softwares, there's many videos available on the Productivity Academy channel on ways to get that done. Um, and if you're into productivity, automation, how-tos, all of that, then subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.